a super fun environment. I mean, I loved how the Big Ten got together and cheered each other on, and it was fun to have some competition from the ACC and get some fast swims in the uh, beginning of the season. I'm always hungry for more and faster, so um, it's definitely driving me to swim faster and train harder for NCs come March. Um, but it was good just to like get some fast swimming in, um, work on my pacing, my stroke counts. So I mean, it was good practice for sure. So this this past summer was like my first real summer of staying in training meters, which was different for me. So I I just feel like that benefited me personally, like um, continuously training, um, staying in Minnesota, and training with my coach has been great. Uh, we have a great relationship, and so that's just been really helpful. And he like he can pick up on different cues and moods and stuff. So that's. That's really awesome to have in a coach, and um, so that's helped me a lot. I think just mentally, um, and then obviously just trying to like look at other people's strokes, their underwaters, their starts, and so like just trying to nitpick on little things helps a lot. Do you train with the McKees? I do. Yeah, I love training with both Connor and Max. They're great like training partners. Um, it was sad to lose Kiara this season, so that's been a hard transition because um, we used to be really good at pacing off each other and that was really fun to train with her. So I'm really glad Max has come up and yeah, so it's just fun to goof around and pace off each other, yeah, even though they're a lot faster. <laughs> could, could you ever beat Connor and Max? Oh my goodness, no. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but I try, so that's good. And then like just picking up, like Max's underwaters are really fast, um, Connor's really good stroke rate, and so just like looking at their strokes and how they do things has helped me a lot. 